on the channel keeping my life in order your life your journey your lifestyle that fits for you and in today's video you guys i am sharing with you my 2023 winter sneaker collection now y'all i've been talking about my tennis shoes for the longest and it's been taking me so long to film this video and and i think it's because i have a lot of tennis shoes in this particular video you guys i'm only going to share with you about 10 sneakers that I have. And if you guys like more videos like this and for you sneaker heads out there, hey, let me know if y'all wanna see more videos. Now you guys, I'm, I am not versed in the sneaker term terminology or for all you sneaker gurus out there, don't come for me. Please don't come for me. Do not come for me, okay? I think I've been collecting sneakers for about two years, no, maybe three years, three years now, so. But still, you guys, don't come for me, you know, with all the, you know, the terminology and stuff like that, because you guys, I'm still learning. Anyway, let's go ahead and get started with the video. So the first sneakers are, y'all, my Air Force Ones, okay? Y'all, these right here, I love these. I think I've had these, honestly, um, I don't know how long I've had these. I've had these for quite some time. Love these tennis shoes. Now, I do like to wear these particularly, particularly like in the fall slash winter, mostly in the fall, honestly, only because it's football season and I'm a Falcons fan. You know, I just like the red. I, it's the red and gray. It's the red and gray for me, you guys. They got, this, they got the baseline right here that's gray, the white. I mean, I just love the colors in general. They are absolutely beautiful now this particular size is i believe it's a grade school size seven no it's a big kid seven wide and for me i wear a size nine so some shoes and big kids i can't big kids in grade school i can wear and i will tell you this these are absolutely comfortable for me i can't remember how much they cost they probably was like i don't know maybe 80 bucks or something like that yep love my air force ones Okay, guys, another pair of Air Force Ones I just recently got are these babies right here. These are the White Coconut Mint Air Foam, y'all. These are new. I haven't worn these yet. Y'all, they are so cute. I mean, I mean, come on now, y'all. And to be honest, the color that the colors, the color pattern are absolutely beautiful. And I think what I like about them the most, you guys, is I like the brown. <laughs> I like the brown in here and how the peach looks really good with the brown. Look at the back of them, y'all. Look, y'all, these are so cute. I really, really love this shoe, and I can't wait to wear it. I think I'm just waiting for it. Getting, I'm trying to get the right look for it. You know what I mean? Cause you know the sh the shoes speak volume, but you gotta have the right outfit. You know what I mean? So I really, 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 really like these, you guys. And I think these were probably probably eighty bucks as well. I think so. All right, moving right along. Let's go with. I'll go with these. All right, now, these next pair of shoes, I've had these for a long time. And I'm telling you guys, when I bought um, my first pair, when I bought my first pair of these, I was like, what? They are so, so comfortable, y'all. And they are the Hirachi Edge, y'all. This is me all day long, y'all. I love this color and what i like about um the hirachi edge is like with the toe box they have like a wide toe pop a wide toe box to them which makes the shoe feels like you know you're just slipping them on your feet that's what makes them so comfortable and the one thing i can say about the um the hirachi edge and also like an adidas shoe they do have that same um toe box in a way which makes the shoes feels like you're just slipping on a shoe or slipping on a slide and so i really love these these are very very comfortable i don't remember how much i paid for these but you guys i absolutely love these and these are also um a big kids seven y and boys as well but these are nice y'all these are just so 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 cute and let me tell you guys something about how i maintain my shoes i get com i get compliments all the time you know are those shoes brand new how do you maintain your shoes you guys let me tell you something my rule of thumb is i have all my shoe boxes okay 
And so what I do is when I do wear my tennis shoes, before they go back in the box, I wipe them down top, bottom, sideways. I write my shoes down all the time and to keep the actual formation of them, all of them still have their papers in them. I don't know if you guys can see that, but I keep the papers in my shoes because I want to keep the formation and I just want to keep the structure of them. I don't want them to get flat or anything like that. So that is a fun fact of how I take care of my shoes, you guys. So I absolutely love these and I don't, yeah, I don't remember how much they cost. I've had these for a while. All right, the next pair of shoes, since we're on this kick, let's talk about, now y'all, this is a recent purchase. I haven't worn these yet, but I love, love, love these shoes, y'all. Are y'all ready? It's the color for me, y'all. These are the Nike Prestos. Now I have, Actually, this is my third pair of these. I have these in the red and black, and I have some all-white ones. Y'all, I love these shoes. Again, the toe box, okay? The toe box is a nice size, okay? It has that oval shaping, which I really, really like. Now, I will say this part of the shoe where your actually um, bone is, right? This part of the shoe of, of the shoe, it can be a little tight. It just depends on your size. These are, again, these are, um, these are big kids, seven wide. And so it just depends. So if you have maybe like larger feet or something or wide feet, you definitely want to probably go a size up in this particular shoe. I will say that. But again, I love everything about the shoe. Like I said, these are brand new. I haven't worn these. Y'all, I just love this color. Y'all, it's the color for me. It I just, it's the color, yeah, it's the color, it's all about the color. All right, moving on to the next pair of shoes. Now I bought these particular shoes because my daughter, she bought me some shoes, but it was a different color. It's the same shoe, different color. I think maybe like a color a couple of years ago. And so I have been looking for this particular color shoe. So these are the Air Mac Axis, you guys. I really enjoy this shoe. This is one of them shoes where I don't know if you guys have, you know, how often you guys are purchasing your shoes or anything like that. But this kind of reminds me of the style of tennis, the style of sneakers that is out right now. Um, I'm seeing a lot of big platform shoes. I don't know if you guys have you seen those New Balances? Y'all, the New Balance trend is everything. And they have like the thick platform on them. But anyways, it doesn't have a huge platform, but this shoe does have a nice size platform on it. And I will say this is a very, very comfortable shoe. Um, I haven't worn them, but I have tried them on. And you know, they are very, very comfortable. Um, now with my white shoes, I will say I am <laughs> very, very, very particular on what days I wear my white shoes. Um, and if it's raining outside or something like that, you know, I'm just real particular about what day I wear my white shoes. And I will tell you most of the time when I wear them, I'm probably not going to be out all day because <laughs> I really, really like taking care of my white shoes. But these are really, really nice, you guys. I like them. Um, I like the structure of them. They are kind of like, now these shoes can typically run kind of big. This is actually a women's size nine for me. And I will say it is a little, just a tad bit big for me, just a little bit, because I think I would have been good if I got a size eight and a half. So you might want to, you know, go a size down if you decide to purchase these shoes, because they can feel, a little, they are just a little bit bigger um, than you know, just your actual shoe size. So you may just want to go up a size or go down a size. I'm sorry. You may just want to go down a shoe size, but I love these tennis shoes. They're absolutely great and they're so cute and I cannot wait to wear them. Okay. The next shoes I have are the Nike MD Volant. Y'all, when I tell you this shoe right here is a, it's like when you put this shoe on, you feel like you want to go running. I ain't kid you not. I kid you not. It seems like when I put these shoes on, I feel like I want to take off running. This is a very nice shoe. It is a very affordable shoe as well. Because I think this, this these sneakers are probably 
60 bucks. I'm not really sure, but they want they want no more than $100, I know that. But you guys, I just love the color of them. They're so cute and they're very 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 comfortable. They're very very comfortable. Now this depth as you can see, this is a very flat shoe, okay? It's a flat shoe, so this shoe would be really really good for somebody that doesn't have an arch in their foot. This would be a good shoe for them because the shoe does not have a high arch and it really, really help with um, people that have flat feet as well. But it doesn't bother me at all because I'm telling you guys, I absolutely, I absolutely love this shoe. It is very, very cute. Um, it's just, it's very nice. And then right here where the laces are, where the shoe holes are, it's like a velvet material. Yeah, I just love it. This is just the cutest shoe to me. It's so cute. It's the color for me, y'all. It is the color for me. Okay. And also, I got that same particular shoe in the black, red, and white. Y'all, I haven't worn these yet, but um, I'm looking forward to wearing them. <laughs> I haven't worn these yet, but you guys, I just love this tennis shoe. Look at it. Look at her. Like, what? Very comfortable shoe and very affordable very very affordable you guys very affordable i just i just think these shoes are absolutely beautiful nice shoe very nice shoe okay you guys got that one okay you guys now the next shoes i'm about to show you are my favorite nike brand of shoe i have been loving this tennis shoe since I was in high school and I just always fell in love with them I thought they were always nice and I have a variety of these and I'm only going to show you um three because these are the last three shoes y'all I love me a good um Nike Air Max yes I am an Air Max female okay so the first shoes i'm going to show you guys in this collection and i bought these because i just knew that i'm not going to see nobody with this with this color scheme and so the first shoe i'm going to show you guys in my nike air max um my air next pluses is this shoe right here y'all look at her y'all i just i just can't it's the, it's the, you know, it's the olive for me. You know, I do have the, you know, the little tiger print up here. That, you know, that's fine. But it's just the olive for me. I love the olive, you guys. I really, really uh, love the olive. Now, I will say this particular tennis shoe, you guys, it heavily supports an arched foot. So if you don't have arches in your foot, you may have to get some... I don't know, maybe like some doctor shoes or something like that. But these shoes are really for, are really arched, um, really have those arched heels. But in the toe box is not that wide, okay? But I will say all of my Air Max Plus that I have, my Vapor Max tennis shoes, I can get these in the, um, the big kids size 7 and boys, and they fit a size 9 women perfectly. When I say perfect, perfectly so i really really like these i haven't worn these yet i don't remember i don't remember how much they were y'all i can't remember but i really love these because i think they are unique and i think that uh, i'm definitely not going to see a whole lot of people wearing this shoe so i like this i also have an air max pluses y'all not these are just it's the color for me y'all Yeah, it's the color. It is the color. And I know I've had these for probably a year now. I've had these for a year now. Yeah, it's the color. Just beautiful. Just absolutely beautiful. You got the red in there. You got your gold. And you got your navy blue, y'all. I love these. Now, when I wear these, I get a lot of compliments on these shoes. I absolutely love these, you guys. All right. And these are some of my recent purchases, but y'all, I have been wearing these now. <laughs> I think I purchased these maybe like a couple of months ago, but these Air Plus, these Air Max Plus is here. Mm. Y'all, <sighs> you ready? Y'all, 
these are like the closest to the all black okay have you seen the all black <laughs> y'all i love these oh my goodness just cute yeah they so cute cute so freaking cute just love the shoe so cute um i just when i when every time i pick these up i'm just speechless i don't know what to say <laughs> but it's just a black and a gray for me and it's just a nice color pattern y'all know black and gray is, is what it's at you know look i got no black shirt look at it i can have my all black and put these shoes on girl the shoes gonna speak value okay <laughs> but these are absolutely adorable these are truly truly one of my faves as well you guys yep so that concludes my 2023 winter sneaker collection y'all comment below let me know which sneaker did you like do you collect sneakers and would you like to see more videos like this thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video bye you guys